Hello there, people of the world. I am about ready to air fry some chocolate chip cookies. And since I know how to edit, I'm not going to do any like magical stuff or anything like that. I'm not interested. Um, but I'm cooking these. They're the miniature cookies. There's 24 of them. There should be 24. Oh, this one has 40 mini. These are mini instead of the small. Brand new product. Let me open them up. Hold on. Let me get some foil in the air fryer first. So I have the smallest air fryer. I'll turn this. Whoa, daddy. Stay up there. You're on my fridge, kind of almost wanting to fall off. This is my air fryer. 2.4 quart, tiny. So in the small cookies, I bought four packs of these because they're on sale. So it'll be fun to see how they turn out. Uh, with the small cookies, I can make eight. I just heard my Christmas lights clicked off. This is the timer is right here on the wall. So anyways, I can make eight of the small ones. And all I do is... These are going to be tiny. Have you ever seen these where you can make 40? I don't know if I've ever bought them when you can make 40. Oh, how cute! Look, they're like, um... Like Tetris. Like, I won Tetris and this is what my prize was. I don't even know how many I can make. You can put, I, I, and you know what? Normally I cook these suckers six minutes at 360 degrees and leave them in to cool. But I don't know if these little ones will go at six minutes. I think I might do these at five. They're so cute. I'm almost like, I think I should double them up. Oh my gosh, it's going to be like a fan of heaven. Because I'm fanning them out in here. I don't even know how many are, are going to be fit in here. Like, and since I bought four packs of these because they're on sale, one of them I am cooking right now, and then two, I bought three packs. Two of them are in the freezer. You can freeze these and unfreeze them. I don't know how I want to do this part. Yum, the daisy. I'm going to put these inside ones kind of close together. I'll probably make one big cookie. You know what? Honestly, I have to cook them at 360. I'm going to do five minutes. I'm going to do five minutes. I was going to teach you how to do it. If you buy the miniature cook or like the small cookies where there's 24 in a pack, I can tell you this. With this uh, air fryer, six minutes, 360 degrees, leave them in there to cool for like literally like 10 minutes. They're not going to overcook in there. They're just going to finish cooking. And I use the non-stick foil. Just a minute. My hands were just clean. So I know they're COVID-19 free. But I need to get them cookie free. Because I'm going to touch stuff. Let me show you the foil. Or is it still out? Still out. This is the foil that I use. You can buy it. It's called non-stick. Ran out during the hoarding. I was like, oh my God, I need foil, and there's no foil, but the next time I went back, they stocked it up. So, what do you think? 360 for six minutes, just go with it? Okay. They sure are cute. I gotta tell you, 360, six minutes, they might burn, but I've got, I don't know how many I cooked. I don't know how many I cooked. Four, eight, 12, 16. 22, 24, I have 26 left. So whatever 26 minus 40 is, that's your answer. So they go into a Ziploc bag. This, even with the small size, this little uh, cardboard insert works just the same. I have a feeling they're gonna burn and I'm gonna come back at the end to, to show you the finished product. Um, and we'll see. If they don't, sweetness. If they do, I'll do another set and then I'll let you know, I'll show you the finished product on those. I'm gonna put these in the fridge. So also, before I end this video, the cat was here and I just sent a, a video of the cat up to like 15 friends a few minutes ago. I had on KPBS and it was about squirrels that was doing something on, let me tilt this up a little bit. By the way, yes, I do have blonde hair, if nobody has noticed before today. I'm getting my hair cut tomorrow, so I'm going to be fabulous, but I wanted to change up the color a little bit. 
So anyways, I was watching KPBS and it was, the that part was about squirrels and the cat was here and she ended up getting on this cabinet that I have across from the television and she happened to look up and see the squirrel. She watched the entire program from where she was. So I'll play the video for you. And it's like, it's not like I just caught her for a second watching the show. She watched at least 15 minutes of television staring at the TV. I sent the video to my friend Artie and I told her I'm gonna teach the cat how to learn how to watch football and make appetizers. Make chocolate chip cookies for me, cat. Earn your kitten caboodle keep. So I'll be back in a minute. Uh, actually, I think I'll play the video of the cat while the cookies are cooking. All right, and then I'll be back with the finished product. See ya. I just want to let you know that I'm watching KPBS right now. It's about squirrels, forest animals. And I want to show you something over here. The cat is totally into this. She thinks they're real squirrels. Have you ever seen anything like that? I don't know if I've told you that, but she likes to get up on the TV, on the dresser in front of the TV, and in order to get her off, I turn on a YouTube video of dogs barking. barking. But look at her focus. She's about to fly across the room and pounce. Okay, we're back with a recap video. The cat watched the entire squirrel part, and then it watched the part with the orangutans. I, I, it was like she figured out that she can watch this thing. It was the weirdest thing. So the cookies have been cooling probably for a good 5, 10 minutes, probably 10 minutes in here, and I have not looked at them. 360 degrees, 6 minutes, cool on their own. They smelled like they were cooking normal, and they look fantastic. Let me see if I can do this without making them slide. They all kind of congregated over to that one side, probably because when I look at that, I had lined them all up good. Now, I need to look at the bottom of them, hold on, to make sure they didn't burn. Because if they did, they're cooked properly, but maybe they need to come out. No! The bottoms. Can you see that? I don't know if it focused. Let me let me get in there. It's, you know, it's my phone. Ugh. Who cares if it focuses? I can't put this back. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, no. Hot. Ha, 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 ha. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Even after 10 minutes of hot, but perfect. Mmm. Toll House does it right. Thank you very much. Actually, all the brands do it right. Air fried cookies. Nothing to wash. Cookies to eat. Cat is now gone. The cat literally, after the show was over, got down and shot. Meow. Which means she wants to go out. <laughs> Probably to go see if she could find a squirrel or an orangutan. She's like, we don't have those back. So I just ate another cookie and they are delicious. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a picture of them. And since I'm learning how to edit, I'll put a picture of the top and the bottom right here. Wait, let's get my hand flat. Right here in my hands. Just like that. So you can see them glisten since I can't get them to focus up there. Uh, also, at the end of the last video, while I was editing, I'm like, oh, I turned it off like two seconds or just a second too fast. I was going to say the cat said, we don't have those down in the canyon, orangutans. She was totally into the orangutans. And on the show, if you happen to catch that PPS, KPBS show, there was an orangutan that picked up a saw and learned how to cut a branch without being taught. It figured out the sharp end and cut the branch like a human. It was bizarro. I love KPBS. So on that note, I'll finish uploading this with the photos of the del deliciousness of the cookies that are just, I'm almost drooling right now. See ya.